I love this. You are one in a million not wearing completely black tonight. At oh. least it's all shiny and fun. We're doing a little vertical black and gold. Yes, love it. And do you style yourself and everything? Or? I kind of feel like I do. You feel like you do? Yeah, well, I mean, I, I have a lot of stylist friends that are welcome to style me if if I can afford them. <laughs> but but you're, you're better off doing it on your own. Cause it's good. Yeah, why not? And what's probably the best thing you've gotten out of Shots of Sunset? The best thing I've gotten is the connection that people have when they're growing through something and I share my life and I'm fortunate enough that I'm very relatable. It's like whether it's mom stuff or relationship stuff, I don't embarrass easily. I don't care. So I want to show my life because people are going through it at home. So that that connection makes it worthwhile. And did you think from the very beginning that this is what you were going to be doing? Or did you kind of think a different route on trying to help people in a different way? That's a great question because I was a very content, successful real estate agent who had no intention of changing paths. And the phone rang. And when Ryan Seacrest production calls and you go, is this a prank call? You're like, okay. Yeah. You're like, I was who like, is? New Ryan? phone, who it is? Uh, yeah, Ryan. exactly. So I just went with it. And it really caught fire after that. You just kind of can't turn back. If I really hated it, I wouldn't do it. But my mom's amazing. People really, like I said, relate to what we're doing. So now I just have to balance everything. 100%. And I'm sure you get so much mail and fans and everything telling you how much you've helped them before. What's probably the best thing a fan has ever said to you that really hit home for you? They went into therapy with their parents, siblings, and because of seeing our dynamic, they've improved their relationship that was, you know, also very complicated and painful and they've had breakthroughs so, so that feels good for you yeah uh, mission accomplished Check. that's right that's right family dynamic means everything so yes and where do you see yourself going from here on out what's the next big thing what's the next step what's it gonna be? I, i'm gonna get married i'm gonna have a child maybe more than one um that's something that we've been working on and yeah. planning for a while now so there very much feels like there's a new chapter for me and I'm really excited to, you know, just be a mom and continue to be a wife. You know, like when yeah. I've already been engaged for a year, so yeah. like it's time. The clock yeah. is ticking. Yeah. And if you could choose any celebrity to name your child after, who would it be? So I'm actually gonna steal Selma Hayek's daughter's name and so she I don't know what was the question? It was like who would if I you could, if you could choose any celebrity to name your child after who okay. would it be so i would say selma hyde's daughter okay. so it's kind of like because it's valentina valentina so when i have a girl it's going to be valentina and that's like the closest thing got it got it well watch for it guys when it comes and thank you so much for talking with us and good thank luck you. to you thank, thank you. you have Cheers. a great night you too.